Me and my twin brother fought so much that that's my advantage in boxing now that I got way more competition than any of these fighters around me because they never had someone to fight that's at the world-class level that me and my twin brother, and we fought over everything. What's one that you can remember just right off the top of your head? A girl. Jamal and Jamel Charlo are two of the fastest risers in the sport of boxing. They are the first twins to hold belts simultaneously in the sport's history, but their beginnings were humble. I'm Jamel Charlo. I go by Iron Man Charlo. My name is Jamal Charlo, the WBC interim middleweight world class champion. I'm 154 pound champion and I fight, fight out of Houston, Houston Texas. Texas. Well, I started boxing because I watched my brother, um, you know, training and he was getting a lot of attention at home. We grew up in a rough neighborhood and, you know, just led me right into the boxing ring. I was really good at listening and being coachable as a kid, which made me a better boxer than other kids who was just learning the sport. Our family took on a, the sport of boxing like as if it was a hobby at first. We never knew that it would be a job. Once we turned pro and started making money, that's when a lot of people got in tech and said, you know, you guys need to develop and be better. Nearly 20 years later, Jamal is the undefeated 160-pound champion of the world. His first interim middleweight title defense is December 22nd, whilst brother Jamal is taking his 31-0 record into the ring against Tony Harrison the same night in Brooklyn, New York. I'm by far the best 154-pound champion. I hit the hardest. I have the best skills athletically. I can move around. I can do just about anything in the ring that I want to. America should bet on me because I'm 27 and 0 with 21 knockouts. And most of those knockouts came later in my career against way higher and stiffer competition. If you really want to win, then put your money on twin. The Charlo brothers agree that confidence comes from growing up fighting one of the best boxers in the world who just happens to be your identical twin. We had plenty of fights where he would think, you know, she like me, nah, she like me. Like brothers do. Why you take my girl? She like him, she like me. Me and my brother, we, we went at it for, for so long that my, my parents was like, if they fight, they're in trouble. Like, it was, it, it started to become a thing of like, you know, y'all twins and y'all fight this much. Absolutely, it was pain when my brother first hit me, but um, I feel like I hit him harder than he hit me. Did you fight in the womb? I think we did fight in the womb. I think I beat him up in the womb. Cause he, you know, I came out first anyways. These two are on the record saying that they will never fight one another in the ring. They're too busy working together, carving out their legacy. When it's all said and done, you will know the Charlotte twins. You'll know why we represent lions only. You had to survive to get here. You had to be a lion to, to fight through this war and to make it to this level that, we are, that we, we've made it to. You had to be a lion. So the only people that we associate ourselves with is lions. And, Lions only became our terminology. I mean, you got lions, you're yeah, ferocious, but the, the male lion you know, normally sits back, but when it's time to harvest, we go out there to eat. Knowing that, like, the sky's the limit and where we came from, we would have never thought we'd been here. So it's, it's almost like a dream come true, and don't wake me up from this dream.